Hello, ladies. Hope everyone is doing wonderful. What's going on, beautiful ladies? What's been going on? I want to hear all about it. All right. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. And if you have not subscribed yet, what are you waiting on? Come on, join the family. I would love to have you part of the family. All right. So today, I want to just discuss briefly with you women. Just give you a little advice. If you're interested in dating after a divorce, everyone might not want to start dating again. I've heard some women say, oh my God, Maud. I would never, ever, ever get married again. Or, hey, if I get a divorce, mom, I am done. I do not ever want another husband. Believe me, trust me, I have heard it all. So, I want to just give you ladies just a little advice when it comes to dating after a divorce. I know it can be difficult to start dating again. After a divorce, trust me, I know I've heard about it. I have not been married before, but I have a lot of colleagues, church members, friends and family that has went through the process and they have shared their experience with me. So, when it comes to dating again after a divorce, and you might want to start again, Believe me, it will be well worth it. You want to make sure that you remember that you are the one that's in control of your own happiness. And that it's okay for you to just take your time. Don't rush. Take your time. Step out. Start dating again only when you are ready. And you want to make sure that you are okay. So that's why I always iterate for you to take your time. Don't rush. Start by taking little small baby steps, such as you might want to like join a dating site. They have so many online dating sites. Um, they have where you can maybe reach out to someone and go through different services if you want to start doing dating that way. It's so many options out now with the way we have technology. So many things are done through social media. And technology is so amazing. So you have so many different avenues that you're able to take. Okay, so like I said, join a dating site. You might want to attend a single event. It's so many events. Now, the world is opening back up, you know, slowly. But more, more events are taking place now. So, you might want to just sign up maybe for a class or check out a free event that's in your local area. You can also talk to friends and family members about their experiences with dating after a divorce. You know, communicating with someone else that maybe have similar experiences or going through something that you are going through or have went through, you know, that helps. Just conversating, sharing your experiences with someone else. You want to make sure that you do be patient and you focus on meeting people who share your interests and your values. All right, I want to wish you good luck. And don't forget, ladies, share my video across all social media platforms. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, click on that bell notification. Anything you need to know about me is listed down below in the description box. And once again, I would love to have you part of the family. So why not hit subscribe? Don't wait. All right, go out, take care, stay safe, be amazing, and always, always, always.
always take care of you. Mwah.